feel free to lay anything there on you me. Go. Now oh, it's preparing. Now it's working. It's on. We're on. We're streaming. Good Lord Almighty. Oh, my God. You did it. You really did oh. it. Holy moly. All right. Holy moly. Um, apparently, we're live. Oh, um, wait, we're, oh, I'm trying to wait for the notification that says we're live, though. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it it before you did. I got it. I'll be quiet. I saw it. Okay. Uh, Sammy, whenever you're ready. Why didn't I see it? Oh, I see it. I love these pre this pre show. (laughs) Everyone loves the pre show. It's everyone's favorite part. It's banter. It's live from the asylum. Starring Elise Yavino. Jennifer Prescott. Carolyn Vesco. Sam Zellbreyer. Later. Maybe Michael Lorkowski is not here right now. And tonight's special guest, Joe Bill. And tonight's suggestion comes from a card. I have that card, my friend. I have a card that I picked quite randomly from a deck. Uh, the card is Graffiti Writer. Graffiti, graffiti writer. writer. Sam, where are you? Are you here? Where are we? Don't worry, Elise. I'm here. I mean, I'm kind of scared. Like, where did everybody go? What did those pills do to us? Don't worry about Elise. We'll survive this. Survive what? We're like literally in just like an empty warehouse. They're trying to break our spirit. I mean. Been through this before. There seems to be a a full kitchen, actually. Yeah, it's pretty tough out here. Ooh, nut butter. Listen, they're trying to make us soft so that the, when, they, when they throw us back in the slammer, we'll be easy targets. But you know what? We're going to stay tough. Bring me mean, Lisa's phone. Oh, I found my phone. Hold on. Hmm. Hello? Hello. I would like to play a little game. Can you put me on speakerphone first? Uh, who is this? I don't like games right now. I'm eating nut butter. I am known as Puzzle. Now, I'd like to play a little game. I'd like you to reach in the cabinet and get the pancake mix. If you okay. value your survival. My survival? Excuse me? That doesn't sound like a game. This sounds a little bit more intense than a game, Mr. Puzzle. It depends how badly you'd like to get back to your comfortable little life at the insane asylum slash bar. I mean, to be honest, we accepted this mission. And I have to say, this place is bigger than my apartment. <laughs> and it's pretty well stocked, Sam. No. Oh, my God. That's a tread. There's a treadmill here. There's like a mini gym. There's no mission. Yeah. So it was all a ruse. If you'd like to use the mini gym, first you have to play my little game and get out the pancake mix and mix up some pancakes. I don't want pancakes. That's how they get you. Uh, well. You could try waffles. There's a waffle machine. I Look, can- I, it seems like I can access the gym just fine. I'm going to go. Thanks, Puzzle. Oops. Okay, that was weird. We cut to the mini gym in this strange warehouse, apparently. <laughs> oh, right. Who are you? Elise, it's me. Jen? Wait, Jen? It's How are you here? I, I, I come here to get a little workout. Mm. I come here to turn my abs and other parts 
And um, I have the most amazing physical trainer. <laughs> okay, wait a second. So you're in, so this isn't, so, cause me and Sam took a pill, we accepted a mission and we were put here. So you come here, this is public? Yeah, this is like Equinox. <laughs> Oh, mm. Mm. okay. Mm. Mm. I'm just that's oh. nice. Um, whoo, you should see what I can do with this one. Wow, you're why don't you work out the gym at your apartment? You have a oh my god, and so oh, there. Oh, <laughs> you're gonna squeeze that ball a few more times, Jen. <laughs> okay, sir, I will. That's good. Keep oh, your face man. up. Keep your face up when you squeeze the ball. That's it. That's wow. it. More more clown on the face. More clown on the face. <laughs> clown upstairs. Bulge downstairs. <laughs> nice. Like they told you, Elise, this man is a guru. He's changed he my like fucking he does life. He's... And your, I mean, you look good, Jen. I would just put that that way. Uh, hello, what's your name, sir? You're really... Yeah, I'm Joe the trainer. You need some training? I, I mean, I, you know. I mean, you're pretty toned. You're pretty toned. You got a ball on you? <laughs> uh, I just got here. I actually you got a cup. In... You have a cup? Like a, like a normal cup? You got a pencil? You got a pencil? Uh, I, I don't. How about a traffic I, cone? You got a traffic cone? I, I, what are you going to do with the traffic cone? Ah, you work out with it. Everything is a possibility to work out with. You got an algebra book? I I really, I just got here. I just got here. Can I, you I look don't... around and see if you have anything that is a noun? <laughs> well, since we're at the gym, can I just use the equipment? I mean, if you want to use the equipment. Maybe that 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 five pound weight? I mean, if you want to try that, that's fine. You look like somebody who's beyond equipment to me, but I don't know. Snap judgment. You want to use equipment? Use equipment. That is, look at that. Look at that. Play that. Hey, yeah, yeah. Make that face with that uh, soprano clarinet right there. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, saxophone. Yeah, you turned it for me. That's a soprano sax. Look at that. Look at that. Cut She's working. Part, cut to another part of the warehouse with Sam and Elise. Please. Sam. Been poking around this place. We got to get out of here. Well, actually, I think we're okay because I just went to the gym and Jen was there. So. Oh, no, they've got everybody. At least I think everybody. Have you seen Carolyn? No, but why would they also be here? They're after me. Well, yeah, but. Look, I'm I'm really confused. We took a pill. We got put in a warehouse. It's connected to an equinox. And now you're saying like, is this like some weird multi? What's going on, Sam? I'm getting really nervous. I'm nervous too. I don't think the government really wanted me to work for them. It was a clever trap. Well, I mean, but they said you had talent. I should have known. You do have talents, right? Like- Oh yeah, I'm very funny. Uh, but talents that the government would use. Prop comedy can come in handy. <laughs> we cut to uh, Carolyn's apartment with Jennifer. <clears throat> oh, it's so. What do you... you seem to be doing? Some kind of exercises. <laughs> yeah, it's a pimple ball workout. I just seem compelled to do it. You and must I don't have seen why. that on uh, television. I don't <laughs> know. I just okay. I heard the craziest rumor: Sam has been commissioned as a prop comedian for the government. <laughs> oh God, that'll never sell. And I, you want to know how I found that shit out? Yeah. I was in his bathroom, stall number four, because he's got five stalls, and it's really weird. Yeah. Someone wrote that shit in graffiti on the side of his bathroom stall. So it's not very secretive, I have to say. Did it say where? Like, we could go find him? Well, I mean, Sam, let's be uh, honest here, is not very funny. Well. 
<laughs> I could have told you that. Look at the bookings from last Saturday. Saturday's show. <laughs> but maybe for the government, he'll find a new audience. <laughs> You know, it doesn't take a lot to make a Secret Service agent laugh. He might find a place there. You're right. They're pretty dour, right? They're like cut to a secret government bunker with Sam and his trainer. <laughs> Look at this. Yeah, Look at this prop. Look at those chickens. Funny. That's funny. Look at those chickens. Look at it. Stare at that. Okay. All right. You got that? These chickens are a metaphor for you as a prop comic. You got to keep the ball spinning. Whoa. Ball down low, chicken up top. You know, this is going, this is going above my head. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> but you're going to raise up to the level of this metaphor and be the greatest prop comic the government has ever produced. I think I'm, I think I'm too chicken for this one. Hey, there you go. <laughs> uh, the police station with the detectives yeah she's coming she's my best detective i need her on this one i'm grabbing some donuts boss what do you want <laughs> i want the apple one that's shaped like an apple that you hold in your hand and i want a crawler a bear claw claw crawler i'm okay i kind of ate all the apple ones but they do have the, the damn it this is a big place you know they're my favorite boss. I need a bigger right, stick. Whatever it takes. I'm here. All right. We got a lot of rumors going around the city about people going missing and being pulled in by the government to tell jokes. I don't know That's, what to make of it. Uh, so I was at the asylum last week and uh, I did get a call from the government. They Venmoed me. Venmo you? They Venmoed me. Money? They did. I said I didn't want the money. And they said, check your Venmo. Check your Venmo. Check your Venmo. This going to be a conflict of interest with the police department here. That you're I didn't. I, look, I haven't even yet. touched my Venmo account. All right. All I right. told them I was law enforcement. But I check your Venmo account because they're pretty sneaky, that government. Oh, yeah. I better take a look. How do you, how do you get on this thing? Well, look, you're one of my best, you, you're my best detective. I would like some intel. You want me to go try to, I mean, I was just there. I don't even see very many people in the asylum. I'll go back. I'll go back. I'll check it out. All right. If you need to take a break, an extended period of absence before to rest up, that's fine with me, but don't make it longer than five hours. Sorry, this doesn't so good. Cut back. Cut to um. Cut to the uh, the warehouse with Sam and Elise. Sam, I'm kind of craving pancakes right now. What kind do you want? Uh, I'll have whatever you're making. Oh, I'm so tired. I had such an intense workout with his trainer over at the Equinox. Listen, I've got some new some new intel for you. What do you mean? I was wrong. This mission is real. Amazing. I knew it. Yeah, because I'm really funny. I'm I'm so funny, Elise. <laughs> the government needs me. Yeah. And I want you to come with me on this mission. Well, aren't we on the Are we going somewhere else? Cuz I kind of like it here. It's really big and like there's like look at the appliances in the kitchen. They have every gadget. And the refrigerator talks to you. They're going to be sending it down the desert. The desert? I mean, Arizona? No. Which desert? I don't know. They didn't specify. They just said not Arizona. I'm sorry. If they say desert, you need a specification of desert. Who did you talk to? Top guys. <laughs> we cut to who Sam talked to. Uh... Yo, yo, motherfucker. Gippy, I didn't realize you were working for the government now. Skippy's got a lot of side jobs. Well, listen, Skippy, I was told to come into this room to get my first assignment. You will get past that door without talking to Mr. Big. 
Mr. Big. <laughs> yep, that fella. Skippy. Who is this Mr. Big? Oh, you're going to find out. I think somebody called for Mr. Big. Hey, somebody, yeah, that was me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, hey, Mr. Big. I'm monitoring a tr drug cartel in Colombia, and we need your prop comedy to steal their attention away. Okay. We'll so pay you $5 million if you help us stop this cartel. Hmm. But they drive war vehicles like the one you can see on your screen. This is a reenactment. I could buy a lot on eBay with that much money. Hmm. Where, where? So I've got to go to Colombia? You have to go to the Colombia, but first you have to go to the desert. Okay. Not in Arizona. Not Arizona. In, so in South Texas. You have to cross just south of McAllen and go down through Mexico, through Juarez, through Mexico City. You yeah. can take a left and enjoy some time in Merida to refresh and then go further south through Panama, through Honduras, through Nicaragua, then skip around Venezuela and make a right and climb a mountain until you find yourself in Bogota. Okay. I got the part about not Arizona. I think you're going to be fine. Just don't forget your props. And don't forget. Go to the warehouse. Come back to the warehouse in present time. Yeah, it's definitely not Arizona. All right. Well, is there someone I can talk to? Do you have their number? Can we go back to them? Skippy. Skippy. Okay, I'm so confused of what's going on, Sam. Sam, why is everybody from the asylum here? That part I don't know, but I know that Skippy was in the office that I needed to go to, the recruitment office. Oh, 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 I think I heard my name. Oh, oh Sam. Me. As your talent agent, which I have assigned myself as, I advise you to consider the options. You got one offer from the cops and another from uh, this international kind of cartel thing. Now, one offers 15% plus free snacks. Now, the other one will give you health care. So consider your options. Skippy. Skippy, can we have some privacy, please? Oh, sorry. Uh, all right. I'm going to go use the fourth stall in Sam's bathroom. Sorry, Sam, for what's going to happen. That's why I have four stalls. Don't worry about it. Go, Sam. Sam. Look, I've been thinking. Yeah. And. Okay. Is it possible? I have two possibilities here. We took that pill. Is it possible that either one, this pill took us into an alternate universe or two, we're hallucinating? Either way, there are some things for us to consider of why that might be true. Both. One, in this place, uh, you're funny. And I mean this with so much love. Yeah, I know that. No, I mean, like, don't you find it odd that, like, I know you're funny, but don't yeah. you find it odd that the government would, like, think you're so funny that they would hire you? It makes perfect sense to me. You've, you've heard me before. It's potent yeah. humor, Elise. Okay. Um, yeah, okay. Well, there's some other weird things, too. Like, why would everyone from the asylum be here why would skippy work for the government i mean come on skippy there's no way the government would hire skippy to be your talent agent skippy's a very mysterious fellow uh we cut to the fourth stall with skippy <laughs> hold on man i'm uh <laughs> i'm 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 discommoded uh i'm trying to get my uh is is uh, someone in that stall yeah, I'm working on my ball over here. All right, <laughs> and, uh, I think we're all sharing the the joint. Uh, who's in stall number three? I could use a square. <laughs> it's me in stall number three. I'm my name is Puzzle, and I'd like to play a little game. <laughs> who's in stall number two? <laughs> yeah, it's me over here in stall number two. I'm done with my. Uh, 
bulwark, and now I'm going to roll a 20-sided dice for uh, charisma points. That sounds fascinating. Well, I ain't got no toilet paper. I'm going to have to rip apart my gun. <laughs> well, That's my cool. little game. My little game involves, do you have anything uh, to eat in that paper bag of yours? Oh, Something okay. sweet and savory breakfast items, perhaps. If you value your toilet paper squares, you will give me whatever you might have to eat in You're this bag. You're me out a little bit, lady, but uh, I happen lady. to have a goddamn cruller. Would you like it? Yes, that's fine. Pass it on. I'll me. shove it under the stall. Whoop. I also got a a protein bar over here in stall too. If you want to mix uh, meat, I'll, I'll, I'll trade you a you bag go. of me, uh, peanuts for your protein bar. Uh, there you go. There Thank you go. Thank you. You both have passed my little test. You're free to go and live and do your thing. Back to the asylum with the detective. Hello, anybody here? <laughs> Hmm. Seems empty. Oh, it's hmm. not exactly empty. I can see you, but you cannot see me. Who? Who? Who's this? Who are Curious you? Curious you should be here, detective. I mean, I have a warrant, and this is a public place, so I'm allowed to be here. And who is I'm speaking to? Ominous yes, voice. I, I am a government operative, but from which government, I will not say. <laughs> okay, you listen here. I can't be taking any more Venmos. I almost got in trouble. And I'm the best detective on the force. But you have to take Venmo. It's the most efficient way of transferring money from one individual to another. I don't need any money from you. I do not need to be bribed, nor do I work for you, Mr. Ominous Government. You don't. You don't. Oh, I like your air quotes. That's very nice work. I oh, can do see you like my profession. air quotes? Oh, yes, I like your air quotes very much. Oh, yeah, very nice quotes. They're very much. Oh. I like your air quotes as much as I like my props. props. This is a reenactment from Colombia. This is a reenactment from Colombia. This is a reenactment from Colombia. We need prop humor in Colombia. <laughs> now, show me your air quotes one more time. That's almost like I'm having deja vu or something. Why does this hit me so hard? That, th that was not a steroid you took. That was purple micro dots. Oh, purple micro dots. When did I take the donut? <laughs> we cut back to the uh, gym at the Equinox attached to the weird warehouse. <laughs> good, good work. I'm doing good work. It's very, very good. I've How's the five pound weights going? Very nice. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, and you got oh, you found some sock puppets. Very sock nice. Sock puppets and Let hair me see. clips. I'm working on my fingers. Very, very nice. So We're gonna go ahead and up your repetitions the next visit. But I'm proud of both of you. I've been here for. 32 hours, sir. Is it time to go home now? Do you have a sense of purpose yet? Yeah. You have a goal in mind, like for life, but outside of this gym? Yes. What about you, hair clip girl? You got a oh, goal I in do. mind? Also, I made you something. A Protein what? pancakes. <clears throat> oh, yes. Let me. Oh, yes. Let me. Oh, yes. <laughs> I so appreciate you. I mean, I feel like my fingers, my hands, my vibe has never felt better. And I'm pretty stressed right now because I think we're in some sort of alternate universe. But either way, I'm going with it. You are definitely in an alternate universe. And uh, because of this, I am waiving my fee for this session. Really? And also, uh, one, real quick, we are in an alternate universe. Tell me more. Yeah. Well, we're in an ultimate alternate universe, but I can't really describe it to you because I need the universe that you're actually in as a frame of reference, but you're not in touch with that universe. It gets very complicated. Maybe you're going to be fine. Okay. Look outside. All I have to say inside. is that you're glowing. You're glowing. You look gorgeous. You look gorgeous. You've never looked better. You've never looked more fit or hot. 
and this gym has changed my fucking life. <laughs> Look how attractive you both are. We You're come back welcome. to the asylum. God, I could use a computer guy right now. Oh, Michael. It's really hard to set up this Venmo that we're now accepting like most of our payments through. Is anybody here to help me? I'm not very uh, savvy with money or with apps that take money. Oh, yes. Do you need oh. help with your Venmo? Oh, yes, please. I started this new uh, government operative slash militant discount, and I'm getting a big rush. Oh, oh yes. If you want to learn to work Venmo, just look at the chickens. Look at the chickens. Look at the chickens. The chickens will teach you how to work Venmo. Look at the chickens. Look at the chickens. Look at the chickens. So you send Look. a buck and yes. then get the buck. Through yes. The yes. Got it. Come back to all... the police station. Bus. Bus. Yeah, hang on. Those donuts had a lot of fiber in them, if you know what I mean. I'm getting out of the... Uh, How many donuts did you eat, boss? Seven, eight, nine. I from the bathroom know. earlier today? Yeah. The donuts you gave me. They were delicious. Yeah. Uh, uh, there was something in the donuts. Something in the donuts? I don't know what you're talking uh, I was at the asylum, and then there was this ominous voice from from the government from Colombia, and you referred to the, you referred to the Colombia experience, and said we ate, yep. you took, we ate some sort of purple, purple, um, and then all of a sudden, like I had this remembrance of something. Is that a thigh master you're using? I don't know. I I, I just I gotta work out. I don't feel right. Yes, everyone work out. And prepare yourselves. Do you hear that? For, for the prop comedy stylings of the alternate universe. <laughs> you know what? I got some new instructions. They said, drop the case. <laughs> Forget the whole case. You're off. Go take a vacation. But you hear that voice, right? You hear that voice. Yeah, I think I do. I think they're saying drop the case. No, no, they were talking. No, no, they were talking about prop comedy. Prop comedy. Oh. <laughs> prop <don't>... comedy. <laughs> hear the laugh. The laugh, the evil laugh. You hear it, right? I'm not going crazy, boss. You hear the laugh. Prop I think you comedy. might be going crazy. Prop We've comedy got is... to know Gladys and Mirabelle's apartment. Ha, 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 ha. Oh my God, Mirabelle, we're getting a call. Should I just answer it? Fine, I will. Hello. <laughs> oh my God, Mirabelle, you have to hear this. I don't know how to put it on a speaker. It just get over here. Are you taking a shower again? Yes, I got to get that men sent off of me that I picked up from my. Little meeting last night. <laughs> well, the man on the phone says he's from the government. Oh, the government? The government. <laughs> Did we surpass the cat maximum of seven, 75? <laughs> oh, maybe they're going to uh, give us a. Will you. What? Where's my social security? <laughs> What? Prop <laughs> comedy? <laughs> my sister and I do not do prop comedy. I don't know. We can't even tolerate it. No. <laughs> I'm hanging up on that gentleman. Hold on. Mirabel <laughs> Cat. No, oh. cut we cut to uh back to the, the warehouse. I knew it. it was a trap the entire time. Uh, uh. Who's, uh. <laughs> who's who's in charge here? 
<laughs> Who, who's laughing? Are you laughing at me? Or are you laughing because I'm funny? Because I am funny. Yeah. <laughs> Señores, hey, señoritas, bienvenidos a todo. Hey, bienvenidos a nuevo prop comedy. El next Gallagher. Yeah. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> I'd show you my guns, but, well, I'm currently handcuffed right now. I'm not that handy at the moment, you could say. <laughs> Sam, Sam, we have to get out of here. We have to get out of That's here. That's what I've been trying to say. We need my ghost lawyer. He can get me out of this Forget situation. Forget the ghost lawyer. We need to escape. I need a key to get me out of these handcuffs. That's the key to our plan. <laughs> Who handcuffed you? What? You're handcuffed now? Oh, my God. At least it's okay. We'll get out of this somehow. Trust me, Elise. You keep saying this. I've learned some things in prison. Like how to escape? You escape prison, we can escape the warehouse. Yeah, but first I gotta get out of these handcuffs. Okay, Just I'm one more pun. Just one more pun. Don't do it, Sam. <laughs> Don't listen to him. Don't pun. Resist it. I can give you something off the cuff. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that. Your handcuffs are removed. Yes. Oh my God. Right. You actually have to be funny for us to get out of here. Exactly. Now come on. I gotta go. I gotta go find my cigar and my and my and my gun. Oh my God. You actually have to be funny to get us out of here. We're so screwed. Don't worry, Elise. I got this one in the bag. I just gotta get my bag out of the locker for that to be funny. Oh God. And scene. <laughs> <laughs> we did it. Woo, we did it. Thank you so much, Joe. Thanks oh for goodness. letting me um, play and, and, and enhance and ruin your show. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. That was so, that was so, that was so much fun. fun. That was such a fun episode. Aaron, um, are you here? I, I saw Aaron pop in at the last minute. and I, I let him in. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm in my car driving. I thought I'd be able to sneak in, but I couldn't. It was you great to in. have you here in spirit. But you're here now. You're here now. Um, Joe, do you have anything to promote for our viewers? Uh, if you're in Chicago in the next couple of weeks, uh, my solo show Rough Cuts is at the Bug House Theater, and uh, I'm I'm I will hopefully have the first draft of my uh, my new improv book, an answer to Dave Rosowski's improv book. Uh, it's called Maybe It's Your Fault, an improv book, and that should be open by, uh, in by the spring. That's amazing! Congratulations! That's, That's so fun. Thank you. Thank we'll you. Go in my improv library. Thank you. We love <laughs> Chicago. We are just we there. love Chicago. I love the All Bay. Right. I love Connecticut. I love Atlanta. I love who'd I forget? Uh, oh, uh, New York. New York. Uh, New York. I did it. New York. It. Anybody else have anything to promote? No. Well, we can promote us next week. We will maybe have a very, very special guest. So keep on the lookout for our promotions That's for the show. Oh, two oh, weeks, oh. weeks from now, sorry. Well, next week next is time. a very special guest as well. Promotion. Yes, Promotion. next week is also a special guest. We all, actually, every guest is special. Oh. Every Sam. Guest. Thank you. Yeah. Sam. <laughs> yes. Sam, aren't you in a show this Saturday in Atlanta? Yes. Yes, I am. One that I'm very nervous about. I'm. Oh, so Sam didn't even want to promote it because he doesn't want people to see. Yeah, it. where is it? What is it? Oh. What is it? It's all flight of Atlanta. Uh, it's it's I actually it's what it's at Limelight. I it's at eight. I don't I don't remember what it's called. I honestly don't. Uh, it's called Bob Prov. It's Bob Prov, right? Improv game show where the audience decides completely all the choices the actors make by the touch of their phone. There's like a little special QR code app. Oh, Audience so members fun. will scan and they will get to choose so all fun. the choices for us to make on stage. Sam, That's you look so, so excited fun. for this. I'm, 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 all, I'm all stressed. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, Daniel does not like 
Sam does not like the one being in not control, so he needs to be in control, and this is scaring him that he can't be in control. When are you in control and improv? That's not improv. I mean, you did so good with the the pun and the prop comedy lay-ons. I, I feel like I just worked you out for, you know, to prepare yeah, you. Look how look how look how improv oh my God. So how improv look buff you are right now. I've never seen you look so improv He's buff right so now. Buff. Ah. <laughs> improv buff. I like this. New to ah. <laughs> it's you all pumped up get pumped all right guys well i will promote uh today's wednesday so a lot more better improv and self-expression we host free jams weekly so mondays thursdays um come join come follow the page and thank you all for being here i hope you have a great evening and we'll see y'all next week all right i shall stop the stream goodbye stream stop